Hello viewers and welcome to Noble Tech. Today we'll be looking at the ESP32 Marauder copy that can be found on AliExpress. This is a copy of an ESP32 Marauder that you can currently find on AliExpress. Now I wouldn't recommend it, but today we're going to have a look at it. On the side of the device, we have a USB-C port, a battery life indicator, and an activity LED. On the bottom of the device, we can find the power switch. And on the other side of the device, you can find an SD card slot. Going into the Wi-Fi menu, we see the following options. We have sniffers, scanners, war driving, attacks, and general. On screen we have multiple sniffer options including Wi-Fi, Pineapple and Flipper detection. We have scanners such as Ping Scan and Port Scan All. War driving which includes War Drive and Station War Drive. And Wi-Fi attacks which includes targeted deauthentication, Karma portals, Evil portals, Dior Flood and so much more. And then we have General Wi-Fi where you can select your access points. Now moving over to the Bluetooth menu, we can see that we have sniffers and Bluetooth attacks. In Bluetooth sniffers we have options such as flipper sniff and air tag sniff and Bluetooth war drive. Under Bluetooth attacks we have sour apple, swift pair spam, Samsung BLE spam, Google BLE spam, flipper BLE spam and so much more. Now let's have a look at the device menu. As you can see there are multiple options including update firmware, save load files, language, device information, settings and so much more. That was a quick overview of the ESP32 Marauder copy that you can find on AliExpress. Now as I mentioned earlier, I do not recommend this product. I thoroughly recommend you go to Just Call Me Coco's website and buy the official ESP32 Marauder, which is currently at version 7, from their website. Now, currently, they are not in stock, but they do come back in stock every now and then, and you can pre-order. Now, another caveat is the pre-orders do take three months, and the official one also does not come with a battery. This is the official GitHub for ESP32 Marauder by Just Call Me Coco. Now, if you want to update your Marauder, click on the following link. And as you can see from the very well detailed instructions here, you will need to download a file to the SD card and then update from there. So here we can see a list of all the compatible devices. We are currently using the version 6, if you've got it from AliExpress, it says so on the store page. So we scroll down and we look for the version 6 of the file, which is this one. Now you want to download this to your computer. And then once it's downloaded, rename this file to update.bin. Make sure that that file extension at the end stays there. Once your SD card is back in your ESP32 Marauder, you will then want to go to the device menu. And then from there, you want to select update firmware. Lastly today, I want to look at a targeted deauthentication attack. So we select Wi-Fi, select sniffers. Then we select scan access points. Now I'm not going to show you this on screen because I don't want to show you those uh, details. Once you have selected your access point, go back. And now go to Wi-Fi General. Now scroll up to select Access Point. And from here you can select one of the access points that you previously scanned. Once you have selected your access point, go back. And now go to the Attack menu, where you can select DOF Targeted. Now once you've selected this option, it will immediately start to deauthenticate your targeted access point. Now I recommend absolutely that you only do this to your own network or a network you have permission to do this to. To do it to any unauthorized network is absolutely illegal in most countries.